Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix the Pioneer account blocked or disabled error in Pioneer 2025. Has your Pioneer account been blocked or disabled? Whether it's due to verification issues, suspicious activity, or account misuse, this can be frustration, especially if you rely on Pioneer for global payments. Now in this video tutorial, I'll walk you through how to fix and reactivate your Pioneer account step by step. Now the error you're going to be encountering is this one. As you can see here, it says account logged, try again in 13 minutes and or reset your password. The first thing you want to do is to log in into Pioneer. Sometimes only partial access is blocked. So try logging in to see if you get a reason or alert. We're going to go back to the application and then enter your, uh, your uh, username and password, your account credentials and make sure you log in. Second step, if this doesn't work, check your email for account status updates. Look for subject lines like account disabled, action required, or verification needed. These emails can include uh, steps to fix the issue or upload documents. You're going to go to your Gmail account and in your inbox, you're going to look for these emails. Now, if you haven't found any emails, you can try visiting the verification center. If you can log in, go to settings and then go to verification center and submit any missing identity document, for example, passport, utility bill, etc. And if not, if these work, you can try contacting Pioneer support by going to pioneer.com uh, slash contact. I'm going to go to this website right here, pioneer.com slash contact right here, and click on it and open it. And here, you're going to use the live chat or open a ticket and include your customer ID, error message, and recent activity for faster resolution. And the fifth step is don't open a new account. Creating a new account while your original one is blocked may lead to permanent bans. A blocked Pioneer account can feel like the end, but it's usually fixable through proper communication and verification. So act quickly, stay transparent, and you'll likely get it restored. And make sure you keep your account in good standing by avoiding suspicious activity and keep your IE documents up to date and only use trusted payment resources. And this was it for today's tutorial. If you liked this video and found this helpful, please like and subscribe and feel free to leave comments below the video if you have further or more questions about this topic. Thanks for watching and see you again in the next tutorial.